Hey guys, and welcome back to another Unreal Engine Marketplace sale. This month it is obviously the February sale, which means we can save 50% on thousands of assets from now until this Sunday, the 26th of February. So in this video, I'm going to be covering the top 10 assets which I found, but as I said, obviously there's so many different ones, there will also be ones that are better than my selection as well. So if you have found any other ones which you want to share, definitely leave them in the comments down below so I can see them and everybody else can see them as well so we can all just share which assets we found on the sale. But without further ado, let's just get into it, starting with the Historical Museum. So this is a historical museum environment with 151 unique meshes, including all the showcased assets in the video which you can see on screen now and they are all high quality. So they include a good level of detail and they are optimised for game ready projects as well. So some technical details of this are it features 151 unique meshes, all of which are AAA quality. You have controllable parameters in material instances for these high quality assets and all of them are game ready and optimised. These assets are also unique concepts and they include high attention to details. The texture sizes on these assets range from 1K up to 4K. 4K for detailed assets, 2K for mid-sized assets and 1K for small assets. These do also have collision, all of which is automatically generated, and they have three LODs for complex assets. There's 77 materials and material instances with 149 textures. The supported versions for this are 4.22 and onwards, so pretty much any engine version you're likely to be using, this is on there. Now this is $35 on sale, $70 off sale, so I think this is absolutely amazing. Next up, we have the Advanced Multiplayer Prone slash Crawling plugin. So this plugin allows you to easily and quickly add multiplayer replicated prone with 8 directional crawling locomotion, rotate in place and rolling. And as you can see in this video, this looks absolutely amazing. So they don't showcase it being multiplayer, but obviously it's going to look the same anyway, but you can really see all the different kind of variations of the animations you're going to get with this. So this features 21 full body animations, a true first person design, so it looks good in first or third person view, which is amazing. It has 8 way directional crawling locomotion, with rotate in place and roll left and right. There is also prone collision, which will prevent the character from going through walls, and there is also a prone block, which will prevent the character from rotating through objects in tight spaces and prevent the character from entering or exiting prone if they cannot fit. And on top of all that, it also has a smooth player capsule resizing. So as you're going from prone to standing or standing to prone, the collision of the player is going to be smoothly updating as well to fit that. So the number of blueprints are 8 core and 3 demo, so 11 in total, and the number of C++ classes is 2. This is obviously network replicated and it is also rigged to the epic skeleton. There's 21 animations and the supported development platforms are Windows and Linux, but the supported target platforms are all. So as I said earlier, if you look on the video now, this looks absolutely amazing. And also if you were to look through some of the code that they have on here, it all looks very, very efficient as well. Now we have the Explosion Collections 2D Effect Pack. So this project contains four explosion packs in one collection. So it's kind of a little bundle that you're gonna get. So this is a comprehensive collection of high quality asset effects for Unreal Engine. With 50 different 2D explosion effects across five packs, this pack is perfect for adding a burst of excitement to your game or project. Each explosion effect is carefully crafted and optimised for Unreal Engine, providing you with stunning visual effects that are sure to enhance your project. Whether you're creating an action pack shooter or dramatic scene, the Explosion Collection's 2D effects pack has the perfect explosion effect for you. Get ready to add some explosive excitement to your projects today. So the main features are you have colour control, speed control and emissive control, and the technical details are there are 50 explosion 2D effects with high quality details and cascade particles. So again, there's 50 unique effects, 50 materials and 144 textures. So that's all there is to say on this pretty much. The video really showcases it all. But again, something to keep in mind is this is 2D. These aren't 3D effects, these are all 2D. Next up, we have Sharkman. Now this is a game ready, low poly model of the character Sharkman. The model contains 9 animations as well, so it's not just the character model, you have the model plus animations. Those being 3 attack, 2 walk, 1 run, 1 death and 2 idle. So this is rigged 
and it is rigged to the epic skeleton as well, with one added bone for the jaw. This is animated, like I say, with 9 animations, and there's 7 demo animations. All of these 9 animations are also in place. There's one character, with the Furknex count of the character being 3058, which is very very good, faces count being 2906, and triangles count being 5640. So as I said, this is low poly, and those are some very good statistics for it. There's one material and material instance, and there's seven textures, with the textures being 4K. So this is a very kind of simple character design, with some simple animations as well, but it's absolutely perfect if this is the kind of thing you want to be going for. And sorry, I've just realized I've not been saying the price on some of the other assets, so very, very sorry about that. I'll try and keep that in mind as I'm going forward now. This one is $12.49 on sale, but full price is $24.99. Now we have the Combat Animation Pack 01. Now this is a collection of punching, kicking and blocking animations ideal for your projects. This is $5.49 on sale or $10.99 full price. This includes 26 animations, those being 8 punches, 1 punch and kick, 3 kick, 3 death, 2 block transitions, 2 block, 2 idle, 1 walk, and 4 jump. So that is 26 in place combat animations with continuity, meaning they're going to nicely blend between each other. You have pose matched start and end frames to the provided idle animations, and you have handcrafted animations from a professional animator, meaning they're going to look amazing. And obviously you can see them on screen now, they do look great. These are rigged to the epic skeleton, and they also include IK bones as well. Once again, not a lot to say here, as you really just see in the video what it is that you're going to be getting. Next up, we have 280 Sword Slashes VFX Pack Volume 2. So this pack includes 280 Sword Slash effects fully ready for your projects. There are 20 base Sword Slash effects with 14 color variations for each of them. There's 280 unique Niagara systems, which you can easily customize the effects to your liking with the particle system settings or your own textures. There's 219 textures, including main sword slash textures, plus additional textures for sparks, glow, and noise. The type of emitters used here are CPU and GPU, and again, there's 280 unique effects with no LODs. There's 672 materials and material instances, and 219 textures. Something they've said on here is a note to keep in mind is because of Unreal guidelines, they had to make every effect to be looped infinitely. However, you can very easily change this in the Niagara system settings, and there's more on that info in a PDF linked on the Marketplace page as well. Now we have the Medieval Watchtowers and Platforms Volume 1. So this is a collection of 9 generic watchtowers and platforms. All materials are tiled and seamless, so you can apply any of your own or Quixel tiled materials to get unique results. This is prepared for AAA, third person and first person exploring, or top down view. So what's included in this? Well you have 6 watchtowers and 3 platforms, 5 doors and 2 ladders. All models are only using tiled materials, all models have nanite enabled, all models have light maps ready, all models have precise collisions prepared for exploring, and all models have LODs as well. So the technical details of this are there are 16 meshes, all of them are AAA quality, and include LODs for all of the models. There's a possibility to explore the interior as well, as they have collisions set up. They only used tiled textures. There is a master material setup, which basically takes 10 seconds to switch to your own textures if you wanted to. Drag and drop ease of customization. Generic and variable looks based on real life references, and this is perfect for RPG or strategy fantasy and other medieval games. So again, 16 unique meshes, all of which have collision with LODs. There's 19 material instances and 34 textures, with the text resolutions being 2K for the walls, 1K for the metal, and 512 for the wood. Next up is the ultimate grind system. So with the ultimate grind system, you can create any type of rail that the player can grind on using spline based meshes. This system is easy to use and allows you to create complex rail designs quickly and easily. The price of this is $24.99 on sale and full price is $49.99. So this can be used to create any type of rail that the player can grind on using slip based meshes. 
This system is easy to use and extremely versatile, making it perfect for any game developer looking to add polished rails to their game. Technical details of this are the implementation of this of a new project is incredibly easy. You can customize the model and the front axle it is on. This allows you to adjust the height at which the character will be located, meaning you can easily change it for different character models. This allows you to customize the speed of each line separately and in any part of the spline independently. So if you maybe want to grind up and then down in the same spline, you can change the speed at which that will happen because obviously you want to go up slower and down quicker. This allows you to jump while inside the spline component. So you could maybe have an obstacle in the way which the player needs to jump over while grinding. This includes in the VFX system, left and right foot, which adds sparks on both feet. You can add different sparks to each spline and change them anywhere while the player is grinding. For example, you might want different sparks on metal than you would on wood. This includes sound system as well, so you can customize the sound at startup, during, and at the end of grinding. This includes a system for collecting individual coins and in the form of an adaptable spline. And this also allows you to customize the regeneration of the coin system automatically. There's nine blueprints, 11 meshes, and eight animations. There's one widget, four audio waves, four audio cues, and five VFX. Something to keep in mind is this is not network replicated, however. But as you can see on the video now, this looks absolutely amazing. Now we have the AI shooter. Now the AI shooter was created to be a starter pack with an AI for shooting game. The price of this on sale is $7.49 and full price is $14.99. So this includes basic behaviours like shooting, seeking cover, patrolling, flanking, sight perception, hearing, damage and touch. This also features a system AI shooter with health, health bar, weapon spawn, find ammo, distance find ammo, accuracy shooting, move, drop item, type target, team select and color material and it also has system perception which is vision, hearing, damage and touch. On top of this it also has an AI precision system, this being low, medium and high which basically means how accurate is the AI going to be at shooting the player or shooting other AI. It also has an ammo search system, a drop system for weapons, ammo and health and an AI behavior system for patrol, search for ammo, investigate sounds, chase target, attack target, and melee when close. This also has a target system for player, AI versus AI, or all targets, and an AI locomotion system for patrol and random location. As well as this, it has a system behavior tree, a complete weapon system, that being damage, fire mode, fire rate, sound, icon, and animation, a menu radial for weapons, a pickup system for ammunition and health, and a system aim offset. In total, there is 50 blueprints within this. And this looks absolutely great. I think I may have showcased this before because I think it might have been free a couple months ago or probably even a year ago by now, but this is absolutely amazing. Supported engine versions are 4.25 and onwards. And finally, last but not least, we have the photorealistic desert landscape 4x4km. So there really isn't a lot to say about this and the video showcasing it as well is also very, very short. However, this looks absolutely amazing and as you can see, it is photorealistic. Some of the images showcase it a bit better than the video, but this does look great. So this is a desert location, high poly desert map, which includes several environmental locations. So again, various environmental locations included with a wide variety of plants and a high poly desert map. There's 50 unique meshes and they do have LODs and there's 18 materials and material instances with 38 textures, with a text resolution ranging from 512 up to 4K. And again, like I say, there's not a lot to say on this, but it does look absolutely amazing. And I think that'll be it for this video covering the February sale of 2023. It's again on from now until this Sunday, February 26th, where you can save 50% off on thousands of different assets on the Unreal Engine marketplace. Once again, let me know in the comments down below if you found any other ones which you'd like to share, which look absolutely great, as I'd love to see them. So thank you so much for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed it and I hope you found it helpful. And if you did find it helpful of me just covering all these different asset packs, please do make sure to like and subscribe down below. So thanks so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.